So guys, I started a uh, same new project. <laughs> but anyways, originally I had the big dots, which you guys can see up here. And then like on the edges there, there's like, it kind of ends bluntly. Steven uh, kind of measured wrong, so it doesn't look as good. So I'm trying to fix it. So down here is what I've come up with now. And I made smaller dots and then I'm adding the half hearts on the edge to kind of give it all the way to the wall look. Um, obviously if you guys see my previous vlogs I kind of mentioned where I should have painted all of my walls like the purple color behind me and then just done this wall pink or just did this wall purple and the rest pink like I know I just I feel like I should have done that and now especially with like the hearts ending like that I feel like it would have looked so much better with doing the whole purple wall but the reason I wanted the purple wall was because of the pink day bed and I didn't want like pink on pink I wanted a little different color so yeah that's how that looks right now. I definitely like it better with the smaller dots. I guess you guys can let me know. I'm also editing videos while I'm up here, so. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna put a little dot or a half dot there, like on the edges with the half hearts. I haven't decided yet. I'm gonna kinda get this finished and see how it looks just kind of like this. And obviously the top rows, I can't even get to. Steven's gonna have to do those. And my desk is in the way now to even get up there. So that's all Steven, cause he's super tall. But otherwise, yeah, some of my hearts were peeling up too. So I've been trying to stick them a little better. Cause I don't think Steven stuck them, stuck them to the wall. He just kinda set them. And I am kinda noticing some of them are off level. So nobody will notice those, right? <laughs> But yeah, that's what I'm doing today. I'm also going to try and get the curio cabinets finished downstairs. And yeah, that's my goal for the day. Well, I was trying to get this last curio cabinet done, but it's getting super dark. And we're going to get some big thunderstorms here. So I do follow a girl on Instagram that lives in Wisconsin. And I already saw the hail coming from her. So I know that it's only a matter of time before we get it. But usually we get it worse because we get all the lake effect. So, yeah, yeah. So this is just gonna get postponed another day. Oh well. The children don't like the thunderstorm, so we have Mr. Gray here because Kit Kat took his spot. Kit Kat is currently behind the tower here. We've got Sammy here. He was cowering over there. It's okay. You guys are okay. I finally got this cure cabinet done, so I changed it around a lot. It's looking way better. I'm very happy with the way that it looks now. I turned that on just for the video. Yeah, this one's more of like a Christmassy theme right now. It's looking kind of bare down here, so if I have any Christmas decor when I get that out again, I might add a couple touches or so, but I got like a Nutcracker mug with the Christmas Alice in the Wonderland, and then I just have a random red mug cup there, so it's looking good. I also completely finished this yesterday. Thank goodness, I'm glad it's done. I did end up putting half dots on the wall with the half hearts. Um, they're actually like not half dots, they're like more than half dots because I wanted to make them a little bigger to make them a little more popped. So I had a lot of extra small dots because that was the one in the pack that I had a crap ton of so I could easily waste a full dot by cutting bigger chunks so if you, I don't know if you guys can tell the one down here is a lot smaller than the rest I didn't really compensate for that one but you can't really tell it's all the way down there so it's not a big deal and I'm most likely gonna have stuff down there anyways if you also can tell here I do not have it fully down to the floor because my desk is kind of in the way now and you can't really see it unless you're like down here. I mean, I guess I could put a couple dots on the bottom there if I want just to like, you know, have it more complete here. But uh, for now, it's fine. I don't have to worry about it. If I did decide it's only three, 
three full dots and a half dot. So I can always do that later, but it's looking really good. I'm officially happy with the way it looks. After Steven got it done the first time, I wasn't really happy with how it looked. I was at the point where I'm like, I'd almost just rather have playing hearts again. Uh, and then Steven measured wrong. So we didn't get the full hearts on the full, like make it look nice and full on the whole wall. So I ended up putting the half hearts on there, which makes it look more complete. And then the smaller dots just make the actual hearts pop more. So I'm very happy with this. Now I'm trying to figure out a few more things for this room. Um, I got my curtains. I'm gonna hang my butterfly mirror up here, I'm pretty sure, because I've been testing that. I will insert a couple photos with Steven now so you guys can see what it kind of would look like on this wall or on the heart wall. So, yeah. That's what I got going on in this room. And I got lots of other pictures to hang up and stuff. I'm currently downstairs, you know, I've been working on that curio cabinet, I feel like for two, three weeks, both of them together. That is like the one job that is just so tedious and so time consuming because I started it, but then I have to wash everything. So I gotta go around like regular dishes every single day from lunches and dinners and having those cleared out of the way so that I can wash other things and I'm now working in the drawers in the buffet which has like been junk drawers or it just hasn't been organized in years and it's taking me forever so I've been working on that and eventually I'll probably do some st speed up cleanings instead of you guys just getting like the updates like this but right now I've got stuff like personal stuff like everywhere so I'm not gonna just set up my camera and be on like high alert for that like right now I have my credit card on my desk and it's just laying right there so <laughs> reasons why I don't just set up my camera and do speed ups because I've just got crap like that laying all over my house and it will get put away properly eventually and it will look nice but for now, I've been working an hour and a half downstairs on one drawer and <laughs> I'm already done. Like I'm in bare feet, my feet are cold because our heat is currently broken in the house. Not up here, obviously, we still have heat up here, but um, we don't need the heat up here because it's hot up here. So um, downstairs, the main level, our boiler is on the fritz. It's not like broken, broken, but it makes funny noises. So I'm just not running it. So all I have is a space heater. And I'm sore from leg day on Monday and it's Thursday today and I was supposed to do arm and ab day yesterday and I was just way too sore to do it and today I'm just like, I don't want to do it, <laughs> but my future self will thank me. So yeah, and I need to hop in the shower so I might as well do a workout, right? <laughs> Make that shower worth it, but yes. I officially hit 2100 subscribers today. So thank you everyone for subscribing to my channel and watching all my vlogs and hauls and thrift store videos. But I'm behind on vlogs. They are posted every week, but I still have a few extra. So I might insert an extra one here and there during the week. Hopefully you guys don't mind. Um, I'm also catching up on some older thrift store videos and haul videos. So I hope you guys are enjoying those. And I'm going to try to get Arm and Ab Day done now. So I will talk to you guys later. Bye. Kit Kat's out here on the front porch and doing some porch time. Hunky cat. Yeah. The rug mommy never put back out, huh? Well, it's got lots of cleaning job here again. It's that time of year. Yeah. Cleaned one side of this really good last year. I cleaned it out. Brought this out to the driveway and cleaned it out cleaned it off just never put it back down because I never finished the floor so I got half of it done and the kitties are enjoying sleeping on the rug that's up here so I guess that's good I'm thinking about putting flowers up in the ceiling in here I saw an idea on Instagram of somebody I follow like a, a creative designer decor major decor person so you know, nothing totally more extreme than I could ever do, but I thought it looked really cool how she decorated the roof with flowers and um, I thought that would be really cool out here. I don't know if I'll actually do it, but 
it's a cool idea and it's something that I have in the back of my mind now because I would rather have like a netting type flower garland that could just kind of go up in pieces that'd be so much easier for me instead of having like custom hang individually but yeah and then I'm also thinking about like dust and how pain in the butt that would be clean so I don't know if I'll do it I just thought it was a cute idea I'll think about it maybe something I'll do so now I'm gonna cook some dinner I did my arm and half workout which sucked but I'm glad I did it showered and actually had to take a quick trip to Menards to get some paint because apparently now here they're shutting down um, like the hardware stores, everything that's not a necessity in the hardware store. So like the garden center, flooring department, lighting department, painting department, they're shutting all that down. So <laughs> I was planning on going to Menards tomorrow to go get my paint for my shelves that I'm gonna be painting. Hopefully next week, cause I'll have the dining room finished. That is my goal to have it finished tomorrow. So, um, don't mind my nasty stove. I need to clean it. I know. Um, we just cooked some hash browns and stuff. <laughs> I haven't cleaned it up yet. But I got my egg. I'm going to have my creamy chicken. I'm going to have a English muffin. And then I've got my cheese already in my bowl here. <sighs> I'll just let my celery cook. It's softened. I'm going to put some Frank's Red Hot Sauce on it. But yeah, we've been definitely cooking at home a lot more. So this has just been messy. And I'm just kind of like whatever because we cook so much now at home it's like we go from eating out every single day to now eating at home every single day which is great because I actually love it I'm, I was getting sick of fast food but yes I am excited not excited about the messes and the dish pile that pops up but you know it's whatever it's daily life so I'm going to put my ramen in now because the water is ready so I have a thrift store haul to film for you guys you probably won't see that for a while because I want to get my other videos done first, but that will be coming soon. Okay. Oh, okay. I'm playing this plug and play. Look at them graphics. Uh, <laughs> cute start. They actually look okay on the, on the phone. Oh, do they? <laughs> nice. I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh, I gotta collect coins. I'm yeah. guessing that's bad. The splots. Am I supposed to get like fuel? Do I have to go in between the flags or hit the flags? In between. Oh, pfft. apparently I was a little too late on that one. Do I go on the ramp? Oh, look at that jump. Oh, I can like just regular jump. I didn't know that. What does B do? I guess nothing. Oh no! Oh no! Here's lunch. Yummy. Trying to get my floor kind of cleaned in the family room. But I have a bunch of storage over here, so that's not probably gonna be, you know, well, it's probably as good as it's gonna get. Because I got like my workout equipment over there, and I have my sunglasses temporarily hanging out over there. Then I got my new couch covers when we get our new couch in the storage building someday. It's just sitting there waiting for us, but I have some videos I have to film. I have a couple unboxings and just wanted to kind of get this area cleaned up so it actually like, you know, looks decent and not cluttered and messy. And uh, yeah, that's, that's what's going on right now sun's coming in so I need to hustle my butt so I can get these videos filmed and I need to also upload a vlog for this week but I haven't done that yet I'm working on it guys I'm, I'm catching up slowly so hopefully we'll get back into the routine of this and then as soon as I have to go back to work after quarantine's over I'm probably going to be lacking on my videos again yay me Check it out. Oh. I don't know. I push the button and like I don't feel a difference. I still have so like five plus containers of them downstairs. <laughs>